What is Apache Hive and who uses it? Apache Hive provides a SQL interface to data stored in Hadoop. Your SQL statement is transformed typically into a MapReduce job. So it provides this SQL-like syntax for manipulating data stored in HDFS. It was developed at Facebook, but it is now managed as an open source Apache Foundation project. Because Hive allows for execution of SQL statements, Hive can also provide a JDBC connectivity layer, Java database connectivity, for tools or programs that interact with data using SQL, they can now interact with data stored in a Hadoop cluster using JDBC. Hive's functionality of translating a SQL statement into a MapReduce job is assisted by Hive maintaining a catalog of information about what data is stored where in the cluster and how that data is structured. This system is called Hive's Metastore or H Catalog. This tool, HCatalog, can be leveraged by other systems. PIG, Java MapReduce, for example, can point directly to HCatalog to build their inputs and their outputs. In addition, other tools for manipulating databases can also point to HCatalog and leverage that information. Who uses Apache Hive? Typically, Hive is going to be deployed with a Hadoop deployment. This is where it was developed, and this is where it works best. If you're deploying Cloudera's distribution for Apache Hadoop, or the Hortonworks data platform, or MapR's distribution for Apache Hadoop, you will have Hive available to you. Big data appliances that come with Hadoop pre-configured, such as IBM's, EMC's, Teradata's, Oracle's, or NetApp's big data appliances, will all come with Hive available. Cloud deployments. You can run Hive directly against Amazon S3 buckets, or you can run Hive across Amazon's Hadoop-like tool called Elastic MapReduce, or you can deploy Hadoop itself on Amazon EC2 instances and run Hive across that cloud cluster. Similarly, you could deploy Hive on Google's cloud or on Rackspace's cloud. Thanks for watching this O'Reilly training video. If you would like more information on this topic, click on Learn More. Don't forget to subscribe to the O'Reilly Video Training YouTube channel for more tutorials. And be sure to like us on Facebook.